the first topic of lines and angles is what is line what is line we will discuss about what is line line it is the collection of points it is the it is the it is the collection of points which can be extended in indefinitely in its own direction and it has no ends point it says that a collection of point a collection of point when we join these points it makes a line and we can extend it it in its own direction understand in its own direction and it has no end point we can extend it it in indefinitely and it has no end point is known as line the another type of line is line segment the line the line which has two end point and we cannot extended it it has a definite length is known as line segment it says that a line it says that a line which has two end point ab is a line segment it has two end point a and b we cannot extended it it has a definite length clear such for example ab is a line segment whose length is 5 cm it has a definite length and we cannot extend it clear the next topic is ray what do you mean by ray ray is also a type of line it has one end point and we can extend it in only one direction clear students ray is also a line segment a type of line ray is also a type of line we can extend it in only one direction and it has ray is also a type of line we can extend it in only one direction and it has one end point clear ab we write ray in the form of ab we extend it in only one b direction we also write in the form of ba we can extended it in only one b direction clear students when we write ab this is a wrong method because a has end point a has end point we can extended it in only in b direction here here a we can extend it in in a direction not it is not possible because we can extend it in only b direction so we write it is in this form is wrong process clear we write in correct method this is a right process clear students the next topic is how does an angle form how does an angle form and what is the angle same question how does an angle form how does an angle form how does an angle formed when the end point of two rays makes common then angle is formed simple when the end point of two rays make common two rays common when the end point of two rays make common then angle is formed then angle is formed clear students when the end point of two rays make common then angle is formed so oa is a ray oa is a ray and ob is also a ray clear it makes at common at point o oa is a ray and ob is a ray it makes common at o point clear then angle is formed at o point angle is formed at 
O point. We write in the form of angle AOB or angle BOA. Clear, students? The next topic is what are uh, what is complementary angle? What is supplementary angle? Uh, students, watch carefully because it is the most important topic. Complementary angle. Supplementary angle. Complementary angle. The sum of two angles. The sum of two angles is 90 degree then they are complementary angle three angle the sum of two angles is 90 degree then they are complementary angle the sum of two angle each 180 degree then they are supplementary angle then they are supplementary angle clear students the most important point of these three topics are complement and supplement when the sum of two angle is 90 degree then they are complementary angle if one of the angle if one of the angle each x if one of the angle is x then its complement be 90 minus x when if one of the angle is x then its complement be 90 minus x clear students 90 minus x same if one of the angle be x then its supplement be 180 minus x if one of the angle is x then its supplement be 180 minus x 